In the heart of Chuckleburg, nestled between the Snicker Forest and the Guffaw River, stood a humble soup kitchen called Giggle Gumbo. Its sign swung in the breeze, announcing, We stir up smiles. One sunny afternoon, Sir Chucklesworth, a traveler with a twinkle in his eye, stumbled upon Giggle Gumbo. His stomach growled like a grumpy walrus, and he pushed open the creaky door. Inside, the air buzzed with laughter. Chef Professor Chuckleberry, a rotund man with a soup ladle for a wand, greeted him. Ah, oh, my dear Sir Chucklesworth, seeking sustenance or silliness. Sir Chucklesworth grinned. Both, good sir. I crave a soup that will untie my shoelaces and tickle my funny bone. And so Chef Chuckleberry ladled out a steaming bowl of rainbow-colored broth, the legendary ultra, ultra, ultra funny soup. As Sir Chucklesworth sipped, his spoon giggled, and the room erupted in mirth. He floated above his chair, shoelaces dancing a jig. From that day on, Sir Chucklesworth became Giggle Gumbo's ambassador, spreading laughter across Chuckleberg and beyond. In the kitchen of Giggle Gumbo, Chef Chuckleberry guarded a secret ingredient, the elusive pixie dust. It sparkled like stardust and smelled like freshly baked ponds. Why pixie dust? Sir Chucklesworth asked, eyes wide. Ah, oh, said the chef, winking. It activates the laughter receptors in your taste buds. But shh, don't tell the fairies. And so every bowl of ultra, ultra, ultra funny soup contained a pinch of magic, turning Chuckles into belly laughs. Sir Chucklesworth's shoelaces had a mind of their own. They wiggled, twisted, and tangled. Passersby stared as he floated down the street, laughing uproariously. New dance craze. Someone asked. Ah, Sir Chucklesworth replied, just the giggle gumbo effect. And so Chuckleberg's sidewalks became a shoelace disco, and even lampposts swayed to the rhythm. Word spread about giggle gumbo. Cows from neighboring farms lined up, eager for a taste. Their moves harmonized into a bovine choir singing, ha ha, moo moo. Chef Chuckleberry Bean. Our soup transcends species. And so the cows became connoisseurs, sipping soup with dainty hooves. The sun peeked through Chuckleberg's clouds, wearing oversized sunglasses. I hear Giggle Gumbo's soup is a riot. Indeed, said Sir Chucklesworth. It's like a stand up comedy show in a bowl. And so the sun grinned. It's rays forming smiley faces on rooftops. And there you have it, five mini servings of laughter from the Giggle Gumbo Kitchen. May your days be as bubbly as a pot of ultra, ultra, ultra funny soup.